And welcome for your Sport Zone report for today. And leading up with some college basketball that took place yesterday evening. And an upset in the SEC Conference. Arkansas defeated 13th ranked Kentucky on their home floor, on Arkansas's home floor, 87 to 85. Impressive victory for the Razorbacks last night. Also, Kansas State upsetting Oklahoma in the in the uh, Big 12 Conference, 72 to 66. Seventh ranked Florida over Georgia, big in the SEC, 72 to 50. And uh, Quite an upset in the Big Ten Conference. Indiana over third-ranked Wisconsin. That game was at Indiana. And a 75-72 victory for Indiana last night. And now we'll take a look at some high school basketball games that took place yesterday evening. And a game that we aired here on YHC and SeawallSportZone.com last night. It was Clarkton over Risco, 75-63. Nice Tri-County matchup there last night between those two teams. And... We'll talk a little bit more about that game in just a moment. And also, Scott County Central over East Prairie, 72-51. to Kennett over Haytai, and what a game that was last night. Uh, got word down there that it was a back-and-forth game for uh, much of that game, but in the end, uh, it was Kennett over Haytai, 73-71. to And uh, the way I recall, I was being told that Kennett was up on Haytai by five at the end of three, and then with one minute remaining, Haytai was up eight, and then Kennett pulled it out with a two-point victory in the end. So quite a matchup between those two teams last night. Clearwater over Neelyville, big, 76-50. Oran over Kelly, 85-45. Charleston over New Madrid County Central in the CMO Conference, 65-50. Crothersville over Holcomb, 91-79. Mullen over Zenith Hornersville, 73-67 to in the Boot Hill Conference. Delta C7 over North Pemiscot, 67-18. to And uh, East Carter County over Naylor, 67-36. to And talking about that Clarkton-Risco game from last night, we're going to replay that one tonight at 6.30. You can catch the replay of that tonight at 6.30 between Clarkton and Risco. And we aired that live last night from Clarkton, our first ever live broadcast from Clarkton. And we appreciate the efforts by New Wave and uh, more specifically Reed Morgan, Clarkton native there, works for New Wave, getting that done and set up for us there at Clarkton. And a really good game last night between Risco and Clarkton. Catch that tonight at 6.30 and we'll be uploaded to SeamallSportZone.com uh, probably later this evening. So uh, very good game there between Risco and Clarkton. And take a look at some game, or don't forget about the uh, Bragging Rights game that was scheduled for last Tuesday evening at the Show Me Center in Cape Girardeau is taking place tonight. And that'll be at the Show Me Center in Cape Girardeau at 6 o'clock, Oran versus Bernie. And following at 7.30 is Sykeston versus Charleston. Big game there at the Show Me Center in Cape Girardeau tonight. So we'll see how those games take place there in Cape Girardeau tonight. Two very good team, very good games scheduled at the Show Me Center. And taking a look at some ga upcoming games we've got here on YHC to look forward to. Uh, we've got one tomorrow night. We don't have listed here on the 16th. Tomorrow night, Thursday night, we've got East Prairie at Clarkton. We're going back to Clarkton for Thursday night's game. And that'll be live here on YHC and SeamallSportZone.com. On Friday, we've got Bernie at, or excuse me, Bernie at Dexter. We'll bring that one live to you Friday night from Dexter. And next Monday night, we've got... Bernie at Hawkham, and it's kind of up in the air right now. Toss-up whether we'll be able to bring that game live to you, but we'll try, but there's a chance that we won't. But we'll have a replay for sure. Bernie at Hawkham. Uh, the 21st, Tuesday, we got Bernie at Bloomfield. And the next Friday, we got New Madrid County Central at Dexter. So those are the games to look forward to next week on our broadcast schedule. And that's pretty much all we've got to report on. For your sport zone for today.